Painting and printing a full color 3D print in Mesh Mixer can be made through the integrated 3D printing services. Building off of the winged shark model I made in the last lesson where I covered Make Solid, I'll now paint it in Mesh Mixer to print in full color. I'll use the Shapeways 3D printing service to print in the full color sandstone material, which are printed layer by layer into a bed of gypsum based powder using binder material and colored ink. The paint vertex brush can be found in the sculpt bucket when you toggle over to the surfaces type of brushes. Here I click to select the paint vertex brush and choose a whitish blue color with the color picker. I'll start by giving a coat of this color to the whole model using a large size brush at full strength. Now if you don't see the color, it's because your viewport color setting is set to visualize face groups. You can change this by pressing and holding the space bar and choosing the left thumbnail in the color selection. Now I can see my color as I paint it onto the model with the paint vertex brush. Looking at some reference imagery of a Mako shark, I can see I want to add a darker color on the top of it. I basically want to fill out these sections of color and then I'll blend them together with the smooth color brush afterwards. Here I add in the grays and dark blues I see in the reference image. Now I can blend the colors together with the smooth color brush found right here next to the paint vertex brush I've been using. Painting with a stencil will allow you to add some subtle detail on top of your previously painted colors that we've blended together. Here I have a black and white image I found on the web with some nicks and scratches. I can import this image as a stencil for the paint vertex brush which essentially only lays down paint where there is white in the image and stencils out the areas where there is black. Here I add some details with the stencil active on my paint vertex brush with a dark color set. Now an important thing to know when using this method to paint your models is that the resolution of the paint strokes are limited to the resolution of your model, meaning if there are more triangles in an area you are painting, you will get sharper definition with the paint strokes. For example, to paint the black eye on this shark, I see that my mesh isn't dense enough to give me a nice circle here. To be able to paint a more refined circle, I can increase the resolution with my refine brush. I can find the refine brush in the volume type section of the sculpt bucket. I just need to toggle over to the volume brushes and can choose the refine brush here. To visualize what it is doing, I can press W to see the triangles. When I paint with the refine brush with the small brush size, more triangles are added to the object. I'm not moving the curvature of the object, I'm just adding more triangles to the existing form. Now when I go back to my paint vertex to paint the shark's eye, the extra triangles I added allow me to paint the circle. Here I just make the brush size the size of the eye and click and hold to paint in that dark color for the eye. Finally, when I'm finished painting and ready to order the print on Shapeways, I can click the print button at the bottom here. My shark creation is loaded into the default print bed initially. Here I want to choose the 3D printing service Shapeways, which loads all of the types of materials I can print with them. I will scroll down to the bottom here and choose full color sandstone. With this material selected, I can see the color that I have painted on my model. And the price is updated to tell me that this print will cost me approximately $35. To make an order with Shapeways, I can click Review Cart and Order here at the bottom. A dialog is presented with the details of my order where I can make any adjustments to quantity and add or remove items from the cart, then click Order. Once I do this, I am connected to the Shapeways service where my painted model will transfer to my Shapeways account. Here I can complete the order for my painted full color 3D print.